All right, cool. So tap, tap, waggle, waggle. Take a look. Great. Okay. So get set. Okay. So we're going to go to P3. Ready? Go up to P3. Good. Higher, higher, higher. Left shoulder down. Good. Now it's going to feel like this. You know what I'm saying? A little bit of unweighting to the lead leg. Do it again. Go to address. Tap, tap. Waggle, waggle. Good. Go up to P3. And it's going to feel a little of this. That's a powerful move. And see how that move is a bit forward? Yeah. Good. Because now as you come down to six, you know, now you have a place to really push and stand up. But that little forward move helps get your swing circle to where you can touch the ground and take a divot. Okay. So I should be doing that. As I'm... So yesterday you were this guy, right? Too much of that. Yeah. Now you're doing a much better job, but you, you, there's no unweighting. And then the unweighting again, remember, if we're shooting a basketball a long way, we bounce the ball, unweight ourselves to use our body. Good golfers have a centered pivot, unweight themselves. So you go, you go, Martin, you're moving to the left. I'd say I'm flexing to unweight myself until my muscles stops me. Then I get to use it. I'm unweighting in a basketball. I'm getting closer to the floor until my muscles are ready to go the other way. So a swing's going to be... See how that's a, that little sling and suspension on waiting, and then we get to respond the other way. Okay. okay, so get your good hands on, tap, tap, waggle, waggle. Take a sneaky peek to your target. Wonderful, good. Hit one for me. Okay, good shot. You mean you clip the stick of hair there. Okay, so just a mild fade. The path was a little bit, a little bit across it. Good, let's hit this one for me. Tap, tap, waggle, waggle. Okay, good. Okay, I'm out of the way. Okay, ready? Give me a nice, nice swing with a sharp hip turn. Go. Do the full swing? Yep. Okay. Okay. So your you're not used to this. Okay, right? And so if I come on back here for a sec, and that's where, you know, a lot of this stuff and, and kind of purposeful slow motion, you know, so it's like, okay, tap, tap, waggle, waggle. Here's my tap, taps. Taps aren't really hand taps, it's more body, you know, for helping me find this radius, developing this backswing. You know, hitting this little shot. I don't have to hit it hard to feel, you know. Mm -hmm. and, and, and then you can hit it hard if you want to. You know, your swing was very much, before it was, you know, here and then unwind from a place too far back. Right? So flurry feet, tap, tap, waggle, waggle. I think you get a little far from it. I think you could be a bit more on top of it. And then like Coach Jim said, you know, as you're turning this sharp hip turn, this lead shoulder is going which way? Down. Yeah. yeah, show me. Okay, tap, tap, waggle, waggle. Beautiful. Sharp hip turn, left shoulder down. Okay. Give me another. Let me reposition this camera. Okay, tap, tap, good. Go for it. Nice, a little, little wipey though. Just a little fady, okay? Okay. So, where, Stay right on me right here. So, okay. you know, so tap, tap, and step forward that way. I'm not going to hit. I just want you to see something. So see how my, my right hand is on top of the grip. Mm -hmm. See how it's bent back and on top. And my pivot can thump it. Mm -hmm. Right? You get a little bit under, you know. So, like, hitting these shots, um, take a half step to your left. That's fine. 
Okay, so as I'm tap, tap, waggle, waggle, as I hit this little shot, you know, and, I, and so even take a look at my, my hands right now. Yeah. See, is my right wrist flat or bent right now? Bent. Right wrist, yeah. Okay, and it's not to say that I, that's, that's not going to release, it is, but as you're learning this a little bit, and you're very super conscious of this wrist being not getting under and opening the face, because your grip's plenty strong, there's no issue there, it looks nice, you just get a little back and open, then you hit crop dusters that are okay, but not near as powerful. I saw a really powerful one earlier, right? So here's your top tap, waggle, waggle, and this pressure's left, and there's a strong little punchy shot out there. Not a high kind of soft one, you get my point? Yep. Okay, and so, come on in for a sec. Put your good hands on it. Okay. Good, now don't move, let me move you. So see where, like that sense of P6, mm -hmm. and how this face is kind of strong, yep. and how this pressure's left and unwinding, bam. You know what I'm saying? Like, you gotta be okay with P1 to P2 to P3 to maybe four to five to see how see how your left hand feels. See how that face is strong. Yeah. And any kind of pivot that any kind of pivot's going to project a hard shot out there. Okay. So show me. Do your best. Okay, this doesn't, don't get too strong, just, there you go, tap, tap, waggle, waggle, you look great. Okay, so almost, right? So that had good force, didn't it? Yeah. Why'd it go left? Because you didn't have the courage to pivot that farther. You see my point? If you hang back, if you pivot it a little bit more, that face projects the ball straighter. Okay, that was crispy though, you dig? Mm -hmm. Good.